Hello, it's been a long time and the main reason for that is I've been suffering from major technical issues so if you're seeing this video that means that I've gotten my setup to work enough. So we are going to, these are all, this is my last save and then all of these were my various attempts so we're going to start from here. All right, so we just played music for her. What are we doing? I'm gonna go... Where's the hotel? So I've finished this game maybe two or three times, like for this, not in the past. I had never finished it before. So again, I was kind of bummed that my reaction was not caught because uh, because it was genuine. I didn't know who had done it, so I was like, huh. Ah. Um, um, what are we doing? What? Oh, how did I do that? Oh, Steno Info. Did I do this yet? I had like missed it for, man, look at the version number on that. Okay. Did I do this? Well, I didn't do that, so. The stenograph, stenograph for, or stroke for S is a small comma. This stroke is also used for the sound of Z. The sound for A. What? Oh, this is how I get the name. Say Ace. Okay. Oh, but I didn't know the M sound. Below are words which contain silent letters. Below each word, type the letter that is not pronounced. Da da da. Da da da. Da da da. I love getting a perfect score. Uh, the, for the E, okay, so long E, long A, little circle, big circle, M, okay, M is a long stroke, N is a little stroke, Ne, Me, Ni, Me, alright, is that that? Or is that something else? <laughs> I don't think I did this. Okay. Mean. Oops. Mm. Name. Me and my perfect score. Uh oh. Alright. O. It's a little annoying that the O looks like a little U. R is a big U. L is the biggest. It's not even like a U anymore. So that looks like a cursive Z. Uh, okay, so. Ray, lay. Okay. Note that or or ol is written with a sideways stroke. Oh, so it can change. I gotcha. But it doesn't always have to be like that in this case. So it's quite a bit to memorize. You know the strokes. Okay, so that's... Mo? No. Mo. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be long. Oof. Ack. I need a reference. Oh. the big loop. Oh, is that? Oh, that's A. Whoops. <laughs> I'm doing all of them. Okay. And then I think, what is that? N. Right! Neil! Okay. Please continue to the next lesson. Are the ones that I want at the very end? Notice the double lines means it should be capitalized. Okay. Lou. Okay, upside down hook is the oo sound. It's o or o, oo. Rule. Okay. Okay. Oof. Okay. Okay. Ugh. With a little vowel at the end, is that an E? Glory. Wait, was that? Hang on. That seems to be significant. A. Wait, gray? Yes. I love getting a perfect score. Here's a quick review so far. Can I just... Isn't that... The name of the carousel horse is Glory. Morning, Glory. What's the story? I can go talk to her. Oh, and just a heads up, because I have been having recording issues, if I have, like, blips where things seem to not mesh together nicely, it's because I probably will be, like, saving, quitting, stopping recording, blah, 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 blah. Um, so just a heads up if things feel a little awkward, more awkward than usual. I'm not touching that. I've learned my lesson. Wait, 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 wait. Oh no. Let me look at my checklist, right? No. Is that all I have to do? Find uh, the key. Okay, don't have that. Take a look around Ingrid's while she's not there. We're gonna do that. Oh, we can't check it off ourselves. Figure out the combination. And I admit my brain is a little rusty, so if I I rewatched some of my video that I filmed of this, um, but I'm still a little hazy. I right, enjoy. Girl, Any I know the name of that carousel horse your mother bought you. Glory. Glory. That's right! Glory! My mother gave him to me for my birthday. My fourth birthday. She died in a car accident that very night. Repressed memories. How awful. How awful. No wonder you forgot how much you loved the carousel. It would have reminded you of your mother. I hated the park after my mother died. I hated the carousel. And I hated that horse. I blamed it for what happened to my mother. I had my father destroy it. But your father did not destroy it. Instead, he stored it. He hoped that someday, with the help of Miles the Magnificent Memory Machine, Don't like you him, would man. come to terms with your past. And because that is what you are doing, here is the third and final riddle. 
Ask Tink for the book you and I used to read about Kessler and Amelia so kind. Give her Tink. nickname a spin on spook number 10. Then the brass prize arrange on its forearm so strange. And something long lost and cherished you'll find. Tink's the guy, yes we do. Tink's the guy who runs the carousel. Let's give him a call. I've got his number. No. Nancy, I did something terrible. I turned the power off to the roller coaster and caused the accident that shut down the park. I blamed Miss Santos for my father's death, just like I blamed that horse for what happened to my mother. I feel horrible. Keep going without me, Nancy. I have to go see Miss Santos and apologize. She wasn't trying to cause the accident, though, was she? Alright, what should I do? I should see people. Holland, Holland. You're gone, Holland. Uh... Aha! Galaxy Boulevard? That sounds fake. Wait, what is it? 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. 101, 190. Again, because I finished this game so many times, I'm like in a whirl. Mega stick, hairspray, a picture, child. Is his hair that long to warrant that kind of brush? Appointments. Louis G. Indeed, who is? That is. Best way to find out is to call him. Mm hmm. Well, there's a two for one at Bonanza Burger. Very tidy, is he? Lots of coffee stains. Got a haircut though. Ooh, 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 can we no we can't snoop. How does Nancy just like know that this is the only important thing in here? If he's the kind of man to write that there's a two for one at Bonanza Burger, there's probably lots of great stuff in here. But she's a snoop, but she's a snoop with boundaries. Ish. Okay, that's probably that's added to our phone. Anything else? He's got a, ooh, ooh. I wonder what's on here. Mm, I'll just play it and find out. Wonder indeed. <laughs> I'll just play it and find out. Okay, you know what? Maybe her boundaries are so-so. Are Is that Ingrid? Yes. Zoom It in. looks like Harlan's been spying on Ingrid. Yeah, that was a very deliberate zoom. Oh, I missed it. I better put this back where I found it. Do I have my notebook? Yes. But wait, what numbers did she press? Hang on, guys. I always do this. I always lose my notebook. We'll just remember. Okay. O seven two six O seven two six July twenty sixth. All right, gotta put it back. Oh, do we have to? Uh, at least I don't make you like m move numbers. Oh, 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 we don't have to because people know. Put it in his shoes. Excellent. Um, my brain is small. Okay. Where is that? That's not that. Is it, it's not the roller coaster. Haunted, haunted house? No, it's it's her. Okay. Doink doink. Have I mentioned that some of these sound effects are also in Jet Force Gemini? Call L H about results. So many phone calls. L H. Lance Huffington, maybe? Lance. Lance Huffington. Good sir. Oops. I need to spy. Mm, teacups. Balloon things. Shark roller coaster. Not that many people sit. I guess two, 
two, four, six, eight. Eight persons. Eight presumed humans. Did we already look at this? Wow. Wow, that's one expensive watch. What? That's a, is that twenty, twenty thousand dollars? And even Nancy, the daughter of a lawyer, thinks that that is expensive. Who gets five hundred dollars an hour just to fight with people? I actually don't know how much Carson Drew makes, but you know, using Clueless as a reference. Water bottle, mind view. Looking at a car. Pandor, porcelain. We can't look at the notes. Can't can't look at anything. Botanical prints. All right. Is there anything else? Some some drafts, perhaps. Bad food. Good food. Um. Talk to Elliot. Employees only. Oh, you're not here either, are ya? Hairdo. All right. Okay, glory. Is there something I'm supposed to take? What am I doing? Oh, I guess I could call people. Telephones. All right, who do we want to start with? Let's see. Yeah, we have, what do we have, three people to call now? All right, we'll start with Lewis. Hello, hello, hey. State Board of Parole, Louis Guerra's office. I'm sorry, what did you say? I said, State Board of Parole, Louis Guerra's office. Mm -hmm. Is Mr. Guerra a parole officer? That's correct, but he's out of the office right now. Would you like to leave a message? Oui, oui. Yes, please. Would you have him call Nancy Drew? Concerning. Harlan Bishop. I believe he's a client of Mr. Guerra's. Is Harlan up to something he shouldn't? The secretary knows him by, like, I'm first name. I'm not sure yet. Would you happen to know what prison he was in? You're going to have to wait and ask Mr. Guerra that question. What was the name? Nancy Drew. My number is 523-555-4399. That's my cell phone. Four, he can call three, me anytime. Nine, nine. I'll let him know. Thank you. Just trying to see if her number spelled anything. You know, maybe Hexy. Um, Hello? Hi, it's Paula. Just thought I'd check in, see how you're doing. Actually, I'm kind of glad you called. Why? What's going on? I'm afraid I've discovered something kind of disturbing about Harlan. What, that he's an ex-con? I know. You do? It was the first thing out of his mouth when he applied for the job. He said being an outstanding security guard would prove to everyone once and for all that he's gone straight. I also found out that he Is used a security camera to get the code to Ingrid's work area. And he fits the description of the jewel thief cellmate that Detective Paris gave me. Oh, now that's disturbing. But I'm still going to give Harlan the benefit of the doubt until I have good reason not to. I appreciate your bringing this to my attention, though. All right. Goodbye, Paula. Hey, hey. Will Nancy Drew please report immediately to the security office? And by I'm immediately, in... I mean don't even think about doing anything else. Oh, I'm in trouble now. He's so mad at me. Am I going to get chewed out? I just got off the phone with Miss Santos. Where do you get off telling her I'm some kind of jewel thieving peeping Tom? That's not what I said. She called you? Of course she called. She hired me because she thought I deserved a second chance. She wanted to make sure I hadn't betrayed her trust, which I hadn't, by the way. She didn't give me the impression that she was going to present it to you like that. <sighs> okay. We're not going to admit that. I know that I now. I know that now, and I'm really sorry. I figured if I did a good job here, it would prove to everybody once and for all that I was totally trustworthy. That I was more than just an ex-con. A lot more. Okay, so maybe I'm trying a little too hard. Maybe people's entry codes should be off limits. It's just that this job means everything to me. I don't want to screw it up. I guess I was a little overzealous too. I I'm really sorry. I'll see you around. 
<sighs> Holland, Holland, Holland. What were we about to do? We can go well, here. Nancy Drew, please report to the security office. I literally just left. You need something else to do, man. I stepped out for a second, and when I came back, somebody'd left this envelope on my desk. Oh. Looks like it's for you. Got your name on it anyway. That is my name, and that's your hand. Very smooth skin compared to mine. Okay. There's nothing inside but a key. Maybe it opens that door in the haunted house. Here, let me toss that envelope for you. I want to apologize for jumping all over you like that before. The more I thought about it, the more I realized that I would have done just what you did. No hard feelings? No hard feelings. We're good. All is good in the hood. All right, will you please let us go? Thank you, okay. See, it's been so long, it's like, what's even? That's not right. Oh, that's right. My instinct served me well. Scary, scary, scary. Looks like Spook 10 is missing an arm. Mm. It's been red tagged. Better not take the tag until I fix this. The arm is missing. Do I have the arm? No. I am unarmed. <laughs> you. It's you. That symbol looks familiar. Oh, oh. <laughs> Didn't I tell Maybe you? Maybe these stairs go down to Kessler's workshop. Maybe they do. I'm afraid pliers. Oh, oh, get out, get out, get what out, was Nancy. That? Get out, Nancy. Move, 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 move. No, 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 stop it, stop it. Bad, bad time. Ow. I guess, I guess we're just gonna ignore that. Okay. Nobody would come after me. What should I? Elliot. Wait, I was already. Why is this music so dramatic? I feel like I was supposed to. Oh wait, should I go tell Ingrid that I found her pliers? Yes. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? Here's your pliers. I found them in the haunted house behind a hidden door, which led to a booby trap. I told you mine were missing. Maybe somebody found them and left them by that door on purpose. I don't know. But they prove nothing. I do know that. Mm. I understand that you know the man who got hurt in that roller coaster accident, Lance Huffington? I, I've talked to him. I don't really know him. What did you talk to him about? Look, what are you getting at? I was just wondering cahoots. if maybe you and he are in cahoots. Are you suggesting that he and I planned the accident? He gets on the coaster, I shut off the power, he cries whiplash and gives me half of whatever he gets oh, wait, from the lawsuit? Wait, but we already know that Joy did it. Theory. Unfortunately, it's totally wrong. I called him to tell him to rub his neck three times a day with witch hazel and lavender. If his neck is really injured, that will cure it. Why are you so eager to accuse me of something? Mm. Because you seem to have a lot of money, far more than the park pays you. I can't help but wonder where it's coming from. All right. I have been making money on the side. But it's not what you think. I've been helping someone design a roller coaster. I even mm -hmm. let him borrow the blueprints for our coaster, so he could study them, not steal them. I kept it secret because it could be construed as conflict of interest. This guy knows I'm taking a risk, so he pays me very well. Now, your turn. It's obvious that you've been nosing around in here. How did you get in? Uh, what am I doing? Actually, uh, someone made a tape of me, which I just happened to see. Which one? Well, it seems that one of the security guards has been doing a little extracurricular surveillance work. Harlan. I knew it bugged him that this place was off limits, but spying on me? 
That guy's got a real problem. As for you, I'd appreciate He's it if you would kindly remove your nice and deficient little self from my office. I have work to do. Nice and deficient? Oh my goodness. That's probably the rudest thing that's ever been said to me. Top 10 anyway. All right. We went and interrogated Ingrid. Oh, we have to call more people. Okay. Party boys. Oh, wait, LH. Wait, does it even matter? Talk to me. Yes, hi. Um, oh, is this Lance bad, Huffington? Bad. You betcha. Who's this? Well, I'm Nancy Drew. I Slime. work with Ingrid Corey. I'm kind of her unofficial assistant here at the park. She tells me everything. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I hate him so much. Yeah, I was wondering if she'd called you yet. You know, about the results? Yeah, she called me. And what did you tell her? Everything's great. Her plan worked. I'm glad she shared it with me. Life's good. At least it will be when the trial's over and the settlement's in the bank. Whoa, speaking of which, I gotta go. I'm due in court. What'd you say your name was? Uh, Nancy. Well, Nancy, next time you call me, you could very well be talking to a multi-millionaire. Ta-ta. Bye. Um, I feel like we should have called him first. You know, for the drama. Uh, no. Tink. I think I'll give him a call. Hi, it's Nancy Drew. Did you land that fish? I don't want to talk about it. Did that answer your question? <laughs> Which pipes? Uh, do we need that? According to the late Daryl Trent, you have a book about Roth Kessler and his wife. Not anymore, I don't. You don't have Aww. it? Daryl Trent was kind of an oddball, you know what I mean? So when he gave me the book, I said I'd hang on to it just to heal more. As soon as he died, I... Aww. Did you ever read the book yourself? Nah, not really. I just kind of glanced through it. Do you by any chance remember Amelia's nickname? Who's Amelia? Oh, never mind. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Now what are we supposed to do? Do you by any chance know which pipes in the band organ play the melody? The pipes in front. Okay. And the pipes are activated Did by air? So the best way for me to this? figure out what the notes in the melody are would be to record which pipes air comes out of and in what order. That's right. Each pipe is labeled with the note it plays. You just need a way to see the air coming out of the pipes. Oh, uh, you know what? I think that I skipped something. Was I supposed to do something with the paper? And I didn't. I think I remember that I just went around that because I just figured it out. I'm curious. Who do you think stole that horse off the carousel? Stupid kid stuff. Or maybe somebody just liked the way old Nightshade looked and wanted him for himself. I don't know. Nightshade? That was its name. Nightshade. Kessler gave all of his horses names. Painted them on their bridles. Have fun fishing. I'm trying. <laughs> They're good with their quirky characters. Okay. Um. Wait, what was that other one? Oh, it was Captain's Cove. Uh, the police, the police department. Um, let's see. Is there anything that we have to do? I mean, everything, but... Find something light to attach to each band. Don't I already... Yeah, because I already have those. Something to attach it with. Do I have tape? What happened to... Sp oh, we... Ingrid's mad at us. I'm so strange. Consult an expert. An expert? Um, these are looking complete. Um. Because, okay, the organ thing, that's just for the harmonica thing, which I already did, right? Hello? This is Luis Guerra with the State Board oh. of Parole. I understand you have some questions concerning Colin Bishop. Right. Hi. Uh, yes, for starters, could you tell me what prison he was in? He served 30 months in Bayside State Prison for check kiting and forgery. 
He was paroled five weeks ago. Check kiting? I've never heard that term before. What does check kiting mean? Was he ever at New Jersey State Prison? No, ma'am. Hmm. Have you seen him since he's been paroled? He comes to my office once a week. As far as I know, Harlan is a security guard at Captain's Cove Amusement Park. Now, do all these questions mean you know something about him that I don't? Hmm. Actually, maybe I do. Oh, what? You failed to mention that he's oh. one of the nicest guys you'd ever want to meet. Very true. Well, I hope I've been of some assistance. Oh, you have. You've been a big help. Thank you. Good day, then. I didn't Bye. ask about the soulmate. Didn't let me. Okay. Am I in the right spot? Tink said the pipes in front play the melody. I need to tape them to the pipes. What's that? I need to tape these down. I don't have tape? What kind of a second-rate detective am I? I need to tape them to the pipes. Okay, well... You need tape to do some taping, don't you there, Nancy? Alright. An office. Joy. You have an office space. I am Molly, I know. magnificent memory machine. Shh, 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 shh. Can I have tape? Dude. Joy has stepped out of the office. Thanks, Miles. The Nancy Drew entity is welcome. Just call me Nancy, you weirdo. You've got to have tape, lady. Hmm, looks like Joy's a pencil chewer. It's because she's stressed from her trauma. Okay, we're not going to pick that up and we're not going to... You're trying to tell me that she doesn't have tape. Come on, what? What? Who would have tape? Okay, we can go talk. We're gonna, we're gonna, we can go talk to Ingrid again. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? There's a dummy in the haunted house that's been red tagged. It's missing an arm. Any chance it'll be up and running again in the near future? Got the arm right here. Just needed a battery. That's one of the dummies mm -hmm. Joy Trent's father created. Probably why the circuitry is so bizarre. It works though, so just reattach it. You'll need pliers. Um. Wait, where are the ones that I took? Oh, and don't forget to take the red tag back to Spy Master Bishop. Uh huh. At least she has a sense of humor. Thanks for your about help. It. No big deal. Wait, do you have tape and? Oh, okay, I got the pliers. Hello, Nancy. Again. How goes it? Thanks for your help. No big deal. <sighs> I need tape. Elliot. You're an artiste, maybe Elliot, but this is an office space. You're trying to tell me that one of these does not have. Maybe I could help you find whatever it is you seem to be looking Tape. for. Oh, sorry. No, 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 no. It's right there. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? Thanks for your help. You bet. What kind of a world is this, Elliot? Oh my gosh, sir. You've got to have scotch tape in here. Hey, hey. It's right there. <laughs> I don't think any of these things are tape. No. So you're trying to tell me that I have located two rolls of tape and neither of them are of use to me? Oh, oh that's just wood. All of this to, to do something that I think I basically already did. Harlan. Harlan. Hey, Nancy, what's up? Uh, yes, I used to have a workshop under what's now the haunted house. Had you ever been down Ridiculous. there? I didn't even know there was a down there there. Oh. So you don't know anything about the hidden door in the room that has the old radiator in it? Sure don't. Never heard any of the other guards say anything about it either. I'll see you around. Go get them. I am trying to go get some tape. I just don't understand what world we're living in. Okay, do I have tape. Uh, uh, I'm just flabbergasted. Nothing? Nothing, nothing, tra la la? What? What? I 
can't believe I can't get tape. Okay, you know what, we're gonna go. It's locked. Gosh, music is really a, a joy. <laughs> no pun intended. Is there tape? No. I need a tool to attach this arm. Oh, it's clamping in. That looks tight enough. Okay, and then the big ring. Whoops. Uh... Oh. I need to take this red tag back to Harlan. Yep. We can't do the thing yet. No, nope, we gotta take the tag back to Harlan. Tag back to Harlan. Tag back to Harlan. All right, what am I doing with my life? Harlan. Hey, Nancy, what's up? Could you please turn the juice back on to the dummy oh, in the haunted so house power. that Ingrid was fixing? Here's the tag. Power. You've really got the system down, don't you? I'll just I flip the switch really... and you'll be good to go. Nancy's developed a lot of skills in her uh, cases. I'll see you around. Go get them. Okay. Odd sounds. Ew. Oh God. Okay. Ooh. I don't like you. Hey. Oh. What? I don't know. Is that what the is that what we need the nickname for? Oh, Tink. Tink here. Hi, Nancy Drew again. Now what? Have fun fishing. Oh, I will. <laughs> okay, you know what I'm gonna do. And hopefully I don't get caught up in a bunch of things. I don't want to call. I'm going to call Bess. Hello? Hi, Bess. I'm also it's nervous. Amy. Oh, hi, Nance. Listen to you. You're probably making Nancy feel terrible. I feel Maybe terrible. Maybe I should answer the phone from now on. You wouldn't dare. It's okay, guys. I understand. I'm sorry, Nancy. As you may have guessed, Matt hasn't called yet, and he is just so, so cute. cute. Anyway, what's up? Okay. Da, 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 da. I'm just gonna jump right in. Got hints. anything for me in the way of hints? I was afraid you were gonna ask that. We're temporarily out. Rude. Okay. What about? Catch you guys later. We'll be right here. Toodles. Toodles. All right, lads, don't let me down. Hello. Hey, Joe. It's Nancy. Frank. Phone. It's Nancy. How's it going? Well, I haven't solved the case yet. Great. Uh, uh, I mean, oh, what a shame. Hi, Nancy. What's up? No, da, 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 da. All right. Uh, we're just Any gonna... suggestions as to my next move? Nothing here or here. Sorry, Nance. Wow. All right. I better get going. Call us anytime. Take I'll care. Go. Maybe if I investigate the scene of uh, the little crime again. All right. Where is it? There's that. I can't believe there's no tape available for me. It's like, I can't even go through now. They're not even going to let me in. Maybe there's another way. Uh, 
I am... Did... Okay, I need to use my brain. Um, let's go look at our... Ooh, see odd sounds again. Um, what's on my list? Things to do. See, but that... Um, uh, as well as something to attach it with. Yeah, can't do that. Consult an expert? Amelia Kessler's. What, uh... What about Paula? Does she know things? Whoops. This is Paula Santos. I'm afraid I can't take your call right mm. now, but if you leave your name number I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Hi Paula, okay. it's Nancy. Listen, it turns out that Harlan was in a totally different prison than the jewel thief. I was wrong about him. I'm sorry if I upset you. I'll be in touch. Okay. Where's the historical society number? Captain's Cove Police Station. Detective Paris, please. Hang on. Hi, Nancy. Nothing new at this end. What have you got? Mm. How much do you know about Daryl Trent? You know, the guy who used to be the co-owner of Captain's Cove? Paula's former business partner? I met him a couple of times. Real friendly guy. Young at heart. More of a kid than most kids. I kind of think that's what killed him, you know? His body just got too old for his soul. Mm. Did you ever meet his daughter? I didn't even know she existed until Paula mentioned she hired her. Thanks, Detective. You've been a big help. They say hi to Paula for me. Mm -hmm. Maybe. If I feel like it. I don't want to call you. <sighs> Trap door. Something tells me if I finish doing everything, I'm not, I better hold on to my hat. Uh-oh. Found out. Okay, bad news. There's got to be another... Someone who knows a lot about Kessler would probably know. Who does? I don't know. Thanks a lot. No prob. A courtesy phone. Don't sound too courteous. Alright. Man, what am I doing? Who can I talk to? Blah, blah, blah. Emergency stop. I think I've found everything in here that needs to be found. A red hand. Oh gosh. Harlan? Hey Nancy, what's up? No. I'll see you around. Go get him. I... Ingrid? No. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? Thanks for your help. No big deal. Alright. You're not even gonna be here. Where are you, man? Here's a book. Coney Island, Philadelphia style. County Fair style. Romance. Factoids. Grab the brass ring. Band organ. I can't believe this guy doesn't have tape. Just wait. Oh, I already got that. Okay, adhesives. No, let me have the adhesives. 
Oh, for heaven's sakes. You know what? I can just look at them. Tails. Hmm. Anything here? Anything? Anything? And I can't... Oh, do I have to do it? No, I already tried that, didn't I? <sighs> wow. Humans, I really don't know what's up. I don't know who the expert is. Wait, maybe... Wait, maybe the, the, there's like a book. Maybe I, can I call Melvin? Is there, is there a magazine with a phone, a phone number or something? Oh, see, I probably, I do, it's the fun. I remember some things from when I finished it a bunch of times before, but I don't remember everything. Hmm, if Elliot wrote this guy's number down, maybe I should too. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You. Everything's good. Everything's fine. My name is Nancy Drew. I saw the article you wrote about Rolf Kessler in the Collector's Hot Sheet magazine. That was several months back, but go on. Well, seeing as you're pretty much an expert on Kessler as well as carousels, I was mm -hmm. hoping you could answer a question for me. I'd be delighted. Would you happen to know the nickname Rolf Kessler gave his wife, Amelia? Of course I do. At least, I thought I did. It was an Austrian term of endearment, rather common. Oh, come on, Anton, think. Spatzi. 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 S-P-A-T-Z-I. He always called her Spatzi. Did you by any chance hear about the horse that was stolen off the carousel at Captain's Cove Amusement Park in New Jersey? It was one of the carousels that Kessler carved. Yes, I did, and I thought, how odd. Because, you see, I'd gotten a call from someone about a month Which? prior to that asking me how much I thought one of those horses would be worth. Really? Do you have any idea who it was that called? None whatsoever. He never gave me his name, he... nor did he say where he was calling from. The thought that I may have actually encouraged someone to mutilate a work of art. Oh. How much would a horse from a Kessler Perish carousel be thought. worth? Depending on its condition, whether it's an inside horse or an outside horse, whether it's the lead horse, anywhere from 80000 to well over $100,000. Wow, that's a lot of money. Yes, it is. But Kessler carved horses for only five carousels in his lifetime. So not only is each horse exquisitely beautiful, but it's very rare, especially if it's the lead horse. The lead horse? The outside horse, just behind the chariot. The place where you can sit instead of ride. It's traditionally the most ornately carved mm. horse on the carousel, hence the most valuable. I wonder if that's true on the old carousel that I'm familiar with at Knobles. Did you hear about how the carousel at Captain's Cove is now allegedly haunted because one of the horses was stolen? <laughs> yes, what a wonderfully <laughs> romantic piece of nonsense. Do you have any idea why someone would be going to the trouble of making the carousel turn on and off by itself? As a matter of fact, I do. I think that someone wants publicity. Whoever stole the horse wants people to know that it's gone so that when he or she goes to sell it, there will be a whole slew of eager buyers. Mm. But we're talking about stolen property. Are you saying people would willingly buy something they the know is stolen? Market. We're talking about the black market, my dear. Great works of art get stolen by thieves and bought by less than scrupulous collectors all the time. If someone did steal that horse off the carousel in order to make money off of it, what would be his or her next move? How would they go about selling it? Well, the thief would probably get a middleman to set up a bidding war between several buyers in mm -hmm. order to get the highest price. The internet comes in very handy in such matters. Thanks for all the info. The pleasure was all mine. Thank you, Anton. Okay. Spatzi. Hmm, Amelia. Mm, painfully expressive. Okay. Spatzi. All right. Okay. So I'm guessing we can't do this. We can't put the ring on the arm until we do this. All right. Spatzi. 
feel like that's in something. Oops, there it is. Oh, were we, were we supposed to tell... Oh my goodness, what's her face? Joy. Okay. Oh, Joy, this is it. That must be glory. Uh -huh. uh, these stairs sure don't feel very safe. Oh. Ah! oh my gosh! Oh these goodness! Are the jewels from that jewel heist. Oh dear! Oh, Joy's father must have left it for her. My dearest Joy, I hope Miles and his riddles have helped you remember how much you adored this horse and how dearly you loved the woman who gave it to you. I found this picture of her years ago, but I didn't want to give it to you until I knew mm. you were ready. She loved you more than anything, Joy. We both did, Dad. P.S. If you want to see where Glory was carved, look for Kessler's symbol on the wall. I could never spend a lot of time in there. Very strange vibes. Oh dear. Okay, so we have I that. should probably take these with me. Oof. We're, we're just going to leave that string of pearls there, though. Makes so much sense. for the stairs. Ooh. So this was Kessler's workshop. Ooh. I'll bet that's the carousel horse that was stolen. Nightshade. Uh huh. Oh, okay, from Hunter at so and so to Dark Horse. Two customers already have two potential buyers. They learned about the hauntings on TV and are champing at the bit. I thought it was chomping at the bit. It's a joke. Horses, the bit, as it were. Uh -huh. See, the sooner they get that horse, the better. How soon can you get two done? 40, 60 split will work great. Oh, we're kind of working backwards. Three to five, um, three to five weeks is unacceptable. This kind of buyer gets cold feet real fast. The longer you take, the more suspicious will get work faster. The second horse will be ready, maybe. Hmm. Okay. We can't do any of these. We can't turn on the computer. Mind view computers again. Ooh. Somebody's been making reproductions, or should I say forgeries? Somebody artistic! Okay, where did we come in? Ah! Nancy, 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 what have you done? It's what you've done. You stole hey. the horse, you fabricated the whole haunted carousel thing to increase its value, and now you're making not just one forgery, but several. You think? You let everyone believe you were just a hopeless procrastinator. But this is the real reason you're behind in your work, isn't it? Right on all counts. Unfortunately, you're not going to get to tell anyone else. Ever. No way. Look what I have. They're diamonds. Real diamonds. Someone stole them 23 years ago and stashed them in the park. Well, well, little icing on the cake. Why are you scowling like that? Fine. That's right. You want them? Here. Ouch. Hey. I've got to get out of here. Yeah. Oh, go. Why can't I move? Oh. I'm trapped. I've got to get out of here. I've got you, Nancy. You're cornered. You uh, might as well give up. Huh? Huh? Ah! <laughs> uh -huh. Soon as I get out of here, I'm gonna call uh. the police, Elliot. So don't bother making plans for tonight. <laughs> or the next ten years. <laughs> Dear Ned, after trapping <sighs> Elliot, I managed to pry the exit open and had Harlan call the police. Yeah. Elliot admitted to stealing the carousel horse and planning the remote control device. He knew that publicity from the hauntings would increase the value of his forgeries. Needless Good artist to say, turns he's gone bad. Back to not liking me. 
Harlan, on the other hand, adores me now, because not only did he share the credit for busting Elliot, but his sudden fame brought him three job offers. He's staying on at Captain's Cove out of loyalty to Paula, but he's happy knowing that being an ex-con will probably never be an issue for him again. Mm. As for Ingrid, she promptly attributed Elliot's bad behavior to a deficiency in some mineral I couldn't pronounce. Nice, and Joy, son. when I gave her the picture of her mother, she started smiling and has yet to stop. Inventing Miles was the best thing her late father could have done mm, for her. Right. In fact, when I went to the park to say goodbye just now, she wasn't in her office. She was riding the carousel. <laughs> She'll Every try yours, me. Nancy. Oh, we did it again. Ooh, 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 I get it, I get it. What am I gonna be? I'm the puzzle master, solving the puzzles using the fewest attempts. Hmm. Thank you. Oof. You have reached 555-4468. I can't come to the phone right now, so please leave a message. Hi, Bess. Hi, George. Well, thanks to you guys, I'm leaving here and flying directly to the Pacific Northwest for some much-needed R&R. George, I just got off the phone with that marine biologist friend of yours. She insisted I stay with her, and she even said she'd take me whale watching on the tour boat she owns. Anyway, thanks Boy. for arranging this little vacation, you two. One whole week of peace, quiet, mm -hmm. and sitting around doing nothing. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> As if. Clueless again. Nice. I'm looking forward to this one. I've been looking forward to this one for months. Whew. All right, if you're seeing this video, I finally got things to work out. I did, I did, I did enjoy this one. Um, I hadn't remembered it. Oh, not that I, yeah, I hadn't remembered it. I did play this like once before years ago and I didn't remember that it was Elliot. And even at the end there, I was generally, genuinely shocked to see him because I had forgotten that that's where he popped up. All right, that's good. I will see you hopefully sooner and more regularly now that I think I have this figured out. Um, for Danger on Deception Island. All right, so long.